Good evening, everyone. My name is Subramani. So today we are going to see the basics of DevOps certifications, right? So the ones who are new to DevOps or uh, if someone wanted to switch their career towards DevOps journey, they can start with this certifications and it will enhance their careers. It will boost their resumes and it will be a good start or an eye opener for entering into the DevOps world. Right? And slowly we will see a lot of other certifications that are advanced and it has a lot of security values and 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 uh, uh, further down the line for level one level two level three exams and other things right to start with right so this exam we call it as a level zero right so this is level zero which is like in typical courses we call it as a 101 exam right in a lot of uh, uh, courses in engineering and everything you will see in level 101 exam which is a foundation exam so this you can call it as a foundation exam which gives you a great eye-opener for DevOps and this is being given by an uh, exam vendor called as DevOps Institute right so this DevOps Institute is a one which is actually uh, preparing this exam. So you can consider this DevOps Institute as one of the global ambassadors for DevOps. Typically like a PECB board or an ITIL board or a PMI board or Scrum board and other things. So these people DevOps Institute are one of the pioneers for uh, DevOps certifications around the world, right? And they have variety of exams in their forum, depending upon the level of courses that we are trying to go and learn, right? For example, they have a DevOps foundation exam, which is DOFD, and they have DevOps leader exam, which is a level two course, and they have DevSecOps engineering course, and they have an SRE practitioner and SRE foundation course. They have uh, a QA related course. Okay. And they also have an observability engineering course. They have a lot of other courses, which we will see in the next 30 seconds. But to start with, I would suggest go ahead with this DevOps foundation course, which is very helpful for the people who are all brand new to DevOps and who wanted to understand the foundation of DevOps and other things, right? So I'll just typically show you how this exactly looks like, right? If you go to Google, okay, just type google.com and then when you type DOFD, okay, the first link which pops up is going to be DevOps Institute, DevOps Foundation course. Click on this and this is the institute name, which is DevOps Institute, and this is the exam name, which I typically mention to you about, which is DevOFD, DevOps Foundation. Right? And you can try to learn it by yourself, or you can try to go to an authorized partner, such as K21 Academy and a lot of other uh, authorized partners around the world who teaches this DevOps Foundation courses, right? So we can try to learn this and then you can buy the exam here on this website itself and then you can write it on your own, right? So now if we see the overview of it, this is the certification badge that you will be getting once after you clear the exam, right? And this, res this badge, you can actually put it on your resume, which enhances your career and which enhances to boost the chances of getting your jobs outside in the market this is a very prestigious and valuable certifications as per your resume okay and this also has an expiry date of two years from your date of completion okay and they can try to learn a lot of other skills as well and what will you learn on this particular journey you will learn all the devops concepts and terminologies you will learn core devops principles you will learn key DevOps practices, the business and technology frameworks, 
culture, behavior, and operating models, and automating, architecting, DevOps tool chains. This is where your CI, CD pipelines comes into the picture. Measurement metrics and reporting. This is where your KPIs will come into the picture, and sharing, shadowing, and evolving. So you will learn all these things as a basics. And what are all the benefits for an organization? You will have a shorter development cycles, faster innovations, reduced deployment failures, and faster time to recover, increased efficiencies, and reduced cost and headcounts. And this can be benefited for individuals in variety of an aspects like this. Right? The certification details are given below. The exam is of 40 questions. You will have a 65% of passing score, and it's a multiple choice question. The duration is 60 minutes. And it's a web-based exam, which is online exam, and you can take exams in these languages. And it's an open book exam. The uh, what is this open book exam is nothing but there will not be any uh, in uh, protractor or an instructor is going to monitor you, and you don't need to switch on your webcam continuously throughout an exam, right? Which doesn't mean you can browse in the Google and then write it. No, you cannot do that because what you have to log into the uh, uh, platform called as web decessor and then once if you start the exam you cannot go out of the screen but it's an open book because there is no one to monitor you throughout an exam that's what the open book is and you have one hour of time to finish this and the certification is valid for three years and when you actually go down you can just see the demand of jobs for these particular people once after you start getting these certifications right and this is a blueprint of what we are going to learn and get out of this course you will be able to learn the calms values which is culture automation lean measurement and sharing three ways of devops organization value of devops the benefits of devops what is a devops tool chain and what is the principle and practices of devops and what are all the related frameworks such as agile itsm lean kanban value stream management and everything so this is a wonderful course to start with and it gives you lots and lots of values and lots and lots of foundation about devops which will be helpful for your career to go towards the next journey right i hope uh, you guys like it and if you have any questions or any comments regarding this exam please feel free to reach out to me i'll be happy to help you guys across right and finally what is the cost of this exam so when you click on this buy exam, right? so you will be able to directly buy the exam. You can try to fill in your details over here and by default it analyzes the location you are in. And on average it's around $270. But when you try to buy uh, three exams, you will get 20% discounts or when you try to attend any webinars that's been uh, given from DevOps Institute, you will get 10% or 15% discount vouchers or you can reach out to your uh, learning partners who can give you a 10% or 15% of discounts but when you want to learn it by yourself and when you want to write an exam by yourself it's around 250 to 270 dollars depending upon the location and the country you are based out of right so i hope this gives you an idea of how much is an exam and what is the validity and other things right i'll see you on the next uh, certification course in the meantime happy learning thank you